Okay guys, so I'm sure that by now you're already familiar with InstaWP's amazing solution which allows you to have a test WordPress website up and running in seconds. Then over time they added many useful features like being able to create templates and set up your own WAS, so website as a service. So it won't come as a surprise when I say that they are now offering managed WordPress hosting. So this is an incredible news, isn't it? But now here's the thing, compared to other hosting provider, they offer a unique feature, which is per site resources allocation. And that's a big one. So that means that the CPUs are allocated by site. So our visitors and disk space. So again, this is a very unique feature that will guarantee optimal performances for your website. Now also, as you can see, they have built-in content delivery network, they have security, uh, they have hourly database backup, daily file backup, and they have data centers in both the US and Europe. Very good, so let me show you this in action. So all you have to do is go to the InstaWP website and log into your account. And as always, you have all your test sites here, you have your templates, and also your WAS. Now, as you may have noticed, there's an extra tab now here in the menu section called hosting. So if you click on this, and right here, as you can see, you can get started by connecting a new hosting account. So we have two different buttons here. We have connect hosting and new site. So if you click on connect hosting, and this option is to connect an external website. So if you have it hosted with someone else, you can connect it directly from here. So what we're going to do is to click on new site. And here's the brand new feature that just released, which is called Insta WP Live. And again, like we said, it's a managed WordPress hosting with content delivery network and full security and backup. OK, so all we have to do now is to click next step. And now we have to select one of those pricing plans. As you can see, you have four different options going from $18 right up to $45 per month. And again, like mentioned earlier, all the resources are allocated per site. So as you can see, two CPUs, 25 gig of disk space and 400,000 visitors. Now, if you go for this one, you will have three CPUs allocated, 25 gig of storage and 600,000 visitors and so on and so on. So again, like we said, the resources are allocated per site. So just as an example here, I'm going to go with the boost one and then we we'll click next and then simply select your data center location. So this could be Burbank, Washington, Dallas, Amsterdam. So I'm based in Europe myself. So I'm going to select Amsterdam and select your PHP version. As you can see, 8.0, 8.1, 8.2. So I'm going to go with 8.0 just to be on the safe side. And we have to enter our domain name. As you can see at the moment is a temporary domain. So I'm just going to type Mr. Web TV and click next. And now you can select the plugins you want to install onto your WordPress website. So these are the most popular ones, obviously, you know, as you can see, Omniscient, Weglot, a social feed gallery all-in-one security jetpack so you can select any of those if you want to install them on your website and you won't have to do it yourself so i'm just going to go live without nothing now just the way it is okay so let's go live and then we get this message here you are just a step away from creating a new hosted site do you wish to continue so let's click next and as you can see it is creating our website so this shouldn't take too long and there you go guys you can see your new wordpress website is now live so you have your username and password here. So don't forget to copy and paste them somewhere safe, you know, so you don't lose them, obviously. And right here, you can access your website immediately by clicking on this small icon. So let's do that together. And there it is. As you can see, this is uh, the default WordPress theme. So this is absolutely perfect. And now if you wanted to access the back end, all you have to do is click on magic login. And there you go, guys. You now also have access to your WordPress dashboard. So now you can feel free to do whatever you want, you know, install whatever it is that you need and complete your website. And once you're ready to go live, we can go back to InstaWP. So let me show you if we close this now. So again, at the moment, we are using a temporary URL, but you can change that very easy and link any domain name that you have. All you have to do is click here and go to map domain type your domain name, for instance, mrweb.tv, and all you have to do is to change your A records with the register of your domain name. That's all you have to do basically, okay? So it's very simple to use and very intuitive as well. And then you have a few additional features as well. As you can see, we have the backups here and more options. So let's have a quick look at the different options available. So this is bringing us to the dashboard. As you can see here, we have all the details related to our website and we have the confirmation that it is connected properly. Now, if you need SFTP connection, you can create your uh, credentials here. All you have to do is add new SSH key. So if you click on this, as you can see, create the username, you add your key and that's basically it. And then we can generate the backups from here as well. You can map your domains on those this like we just did you know just to connect your actual domain name and you can also delete the instance if you wanted to 
So there you go guys, another great hosting provider now available on the market. And again, what makes InstaWP Live stand out from other hosting providers is that they allocate resources per site. So if you'd like to give them a go as always, I'll leave all the details in the description below. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.